Hey everybody, this is Drew with Acoustic Collectibles. Welcome back to a brand new video. Uh, in today's video, which is one of my favorite type of videos to share, is Tone to Morgan Dollars. Um, we have a whole bunch to show you guys today. Um, we can't wait to show you guys um, the flashiness of them, the color on them, the unique parts about them, uh, the uni unique dates we actually picked up too at the Broken Arrow Show. Um, so stay tuned. Um, and all these coins will be in our description below uh, if you guys are interested in them. Uh, they might have sold out, but like I said, check below. And we always have amazing coins uh, to sell. Um, but let's take these up to the light box and show you guys everything that we have. Alrighty guys, just made it up to the light box, and as you guys heard earlier, these are my favorite types of videos to film. The toned coins were awesome at the Broken Arrow show, but let me jump into it right now and show you guys everything that we found. So, this is an 1881S MS61 Star, and the reason why I picked this coin up is because it has that flash to it, it has the 80, 81S appeal to it, and the, the toning was pretty nice as well. Um, I love the orientation or the way it was kind of placed on the coin. I love these kind of crescents that go a little bit over the head. Um, and I also just enjoy this blue and kind of reddish yellow popping out. Um, and the unique part about this coin too is 61 stars are pretty hard to find. Just because it's a rarity of a grade. Uh, most coins you'll find are either AU58 or MS62. So a coin like this with the color uh, I had to pick up had to show some people um, that, that I found it and they, they really liked it too you know it's a common date but it's a it's a middle-of-the-road toner for some, most people and so it's something that I'm fortunate enough to offer a few of my customers so let's jump into the next tone coin alrighty so this is an 1898 Morgan dollar graded MS 63 um, the cool part about this coin, it does have that greenish terminal toning to it. Nothing too ugly like a black or a brown. Um, it is getting that auburn darkness a little bit here, but it was taken out of where it was before it turned too dark. But it has this green and this purple, which really make the coin pop. Um, it has a decent grade as well. And for 1898, um, it's pretty hard to find a coin with this toning. Um, it's a little bit better of a date. Uh, rather than an 1881S or anything of that uh, of the, of that date or those common years, so and the, the reverse is pretty nice too. It has some color to it. I like the kind of the crescent kind of trickling down on the right side. Um, pretty unique coin, um, but let's jump into the next one. This is probably my favorite one of the batch, and I'm gonna tell you guys a few reasons why. This is an 1878. Uh, Eight tail feather, uh, great great MS62 plus. Um, this coin, uh, the reason why I like it so much is because of the grade, but the color really makes the coin pop as well. Um, MS62 plus is not, something you don't see too often, but also color like this on an 1878 eight tail feather is pretty unique, pretty tough. And, uh, I, you know, I would really push you guys to look up the true view on this coin. It is immaculate. And for most toners, when I post them, they don't sell right away. But this coin did. And I don't, I'm don't. i not surprised at all. Because when you're looking for a tone coin, I would be looking for a better date tone coin. And so an 1878 eight tail feather um, is one of those coins, um, and there's a lot of big collectors out there that like that that type of toning, um, this nice, rich, deep toning to a, a coin. But and what but what really sends it home is that it's not an 1881s; it's that it's an eight tail feather 1878. Um, and so I got away with I think charging a couple hundred dollars over uh, price guide uh, to sell this coin just because it is pretty tough to find. Like I said, so. Um, the grade also was pretty cool, so I thought, you know what, why not pick it up and, uh, and buy it. So, let's jump into a few more. Um, the next one is pretty cool as well. So, I don't buy 1881S's a whole lot. Well, I do. Um, but in this, in this kind of holder, I don't like it. 
just because it's going to take a little bit longer for it to sell because it's in this holder. But when I saw this coin under the light, I was like, I had to buy it. And you see that pink, the gold, and the blue shooting out off this coin. Um, wow. <laughs> wow. The luster on it's amazing. The color on it's amazing. Um, but like I said, I'm going to have to move this to PCGS to get a true view for it. But I got it for a reasonable price. Um, and like I said, when you get that kind of flashy color to it, many people get drawn to that. And so... Uh, I couldn't I couldn't help myself. I had to pick this coin up. It was pretty cool. Um, and, and most of the time, we talked a little bit about kind of uh, ICG holders um, in the past. But most of, them, most of the time, they throw in, like, questionable color coins or, um, you know, uh, details coins or clean coins. But this coin, when I, when I looked at it, um, I, I took it away from its face holder of the coin, and it kind of looked at it underneath uh, my loop. And I felt like I uh, the grade was agreeable at a 63 or 64 kind of uh, kind of level. Um, so this coin is going to be a, a great great coin for PCGS, and I can't wait to send it in. So up next is a little bit tougher of a date as well. Um, this is an 1878 uh, reverse of a 78 um, graded MS 63 star. I was at the Broken Arrow show, and the dealer passed by me, and he's like, "Hey." Uh, he knows I like toning. He knows I have uh, dealers for toning, um, dealers and customers for toning. So he's like, hey, what would you pay for this coin? I don't have many people that buy this stuff. And uh, I, I offered him a really reasonable price. I think it was $125 over uh, price guide for this coin. Um, he accepted the offer and uh, found this uh, found a home for this coin pretty quickly as well. Um, as you can kind of see, uh, and the trend is for 1878s, you can kind of see this really nice luster on the coin and the eye appeals there as well as you can see from the star but also as you can see from the color and 1878p's um, they're really tough um, with color and they're just hard to find and so anything that I recommend to you guys is find a coin with nice luster and a better better date and better color and you will be finding a coin um, that you will love and most likely your customers will love too so really nice coin uh, but let's jump into the next one. And I've been on a star kick as of lately, as you guys know. Uh, they've been jumping and soaring in price. This is an 1882S MS63 star. Bought a lot of these coins from the same gentleman. Uh, his name's Nomad Numismatics. He's been on Instagram for a long time. Um, but when he's at shows, he offers the best deals for you. So uh, this coin was really nice. Um... I love the uh, the blue kind of I like I like kind of like the color progression. It's not too flashy, um, but like I said, it is a star. Um, it has do has does have some nice color to it, um, and it really does have this kind of flashy to it on the on the obverse as well. Um, I like any any star coins for the right price and with some nice color on it, and this one met the mark for me. Um, 1882s is pretty uh, is a nice date as well, so. Um, I'm really fortunate enough, and I'm so thankful that I was able to work with Mr. Nomad um, on, on buying some of these coins. So uh, let me show you guys a few more, and then we'll wrap up today's video. So this is another coin that we got from him, and this is an 18830 MS61. Kind of an odd, weird date, but that's okay. Um, the th cool thing I like about it is that kind of nice, interesting crescent. There is a cool separation between the colors. You can kind of see that white, pink, blue, green, uh, and a kind of a red kind of shooting up there. Um, the true views on this one's pretty cool as well. I do like the interesting grade, like I said. And uh, we got it for a pretty fair price. And uh, I actually bundled a whole bunch of coins uh, together for uh, a customer that likes tone coins. And so uh, all, a lot of these are sold already. But whatever is remaining will be on the website for you guys to take a look at. And uh, if you guys want to, and feel free to, please uh, stop by our website. Our, uh, our link is in the description below. So, we have one more coin for you guys to see today. Um, I'm going to give you guys a few practical tips about buying something like this. So, um, this is an 1881S uh, MS62 dimple. Um, and the interesting part about this coin is that... Um, Dimples and PLs are, are pretty hard to find in um, in PCGS Rattlers right now. 
um, people like stacking these um, just because there wasn't too many that were uh, labeled this back then um, and so when I what I would say to you is that even if you have to pay a little bit over price guide sometimes for Rattler with the PL or dimple designation uh, have no fear you'll find a customer for it because uh, the Rattler is very desirable but also the paper is and the coin is in the Rattler so um, this coin had everything for us and uh, I picked it up at the show I walked around and a dealer said hey I was looking at the that dimple that you bought can I buy it from you now and so I was like you know hey sure and so uh, he ended up giving me the money last night and I'm actually gonna ship this tomorrow afternoon and so um, like I said again though um, if you find a PL or a dimple in a rattler um, and it's you know at price guide or even below that maybe around gray sheet that's that's something that you should buy because you're always gonna make some money on it and these are always in demand so I appreciate you guys taking a look at all these tone coins like wow but uh, let's let's hit it to the outro and uh, yeah thank you guys hey everybody I hope you enjoyed today's video uh, a lot of cool toned Morgan dollars um, that we had on display today a whole different variety and range of uh, toning patterns hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you did please make sure to leave a like uh, subscribe if you're new more content every single week and uh, make sure to uh, just uh, check out our website you know, a lot of new coins on there that you might like um, but we'll see you guys in the next video take care